This video was filmed on the first day of spring and I'm back out after the rabbits again. And as I'm making my way down to the first field, I can see that there's a couple out feeding here and a few more the opposite side of the hedge. Looks like it's going to be another busy year for me on the rabbits. So I start to stalk my way in nice and slowly and trying to be as quiet as I can on this gravel track. And as I get to the gateway here, I shoulder the rifle and there's a lot more rabbits here than I thought there was. But these ones down this hedgerow just will not sit and give me the chance of a shot. And they dive for cover as soon as they spot my movement here. So I'll try the other side of the hedge and see if any of those rabbits stayed put. And as I creep my way around this post here, I can see that there's a rabbit within my range. I very slowly ease the rifle around the corner, hoping that the rabbit doesn't spot me. it starts to make its way closer in. And then out pops another one from the hedge here. So I've got now two potential targets. And as you can see, both the rabbits are totally relaxed here and oblivious to my presence. And they're just playing and running around. just have to be patient here and wait for the, one of the rabbits to stop and give me a nice clean shot. And as soon as it does, I line up on it, settle my crosshairs and slip the trigger. And I take the first rabbit of the evening with a nice clean brain shot there. And there we go, that's the first rabbit off this farm this evening. Uh, that was a nice clean headshot, just at the base of the ear there and out the other side. That rabbit was 40 yards and a nice clean kill. And I can see this rabbit is a nice healthy one, checking the eyes there, there's no pus around them. And uh, the anal cavity is all clear as well, which is something else I'll check. But, uh, and the fur is the other thing. This rabbit's in good condition. So off camera now, I'm just gonna gut this one and I'll stick it in the bag and we'll continue around the fields and see what else is around. But it's a nice warm evening and the rabbits, as you've seen, are out feeding quite happily. Right. Okay, I'm gonna go down that way and go to the next field across and work the uh, fields with the wind. making my way here into the next field that often produces a rabbit or two up the side of this hedge and this is where knowing your farm really good pays dividends as I can sneak up here using the telegraph post and the hedge to disguise my approach and get me in close proximity of any rabbits that there may be and I'm in luck and there's one sat out feeding about 43 yards here Again, I take aim for a headshot and drop it nice and cleanly. That's the second one in the bag.
there we go. There's the second rabbit of the evening. Again, a nice clean kill, straight through the brain and out the other side. That rabbit was just coming out of the uh, burrow there and I spotted it and took it nicely. So that's number two in the bag. I apologise about the noise in the background there. Some lads uh, riding a scramblers around in the field behind me. So I'm going to work my way up to the top fields now, away from the noise, after I've gutted this rabbit. Okay, we'll carry on. I often get asked on YouTube why I shoot rabbits. Well, here's one of the reasons that I shoot rabbits coming up now. And here's some more damages that's been done again here this year along all this hedgerow. You can see the uh, rabbits here just digging constantly, undermining the hedges, and eventually they'll collapse. So, uh, need to stop them before they uh, do too much damage. Further on into the evening, and I'm working my way down this hedge line here and I'm stalking my way into another rabbit that I've estimated to be about 40 odd yards away. The rabbit is aware of my presence as I haven't got a lot of cover here behind me to hide my silhouette. But I'm just bluffing my way in here and hoping the rabbit will stay put. And I take aim here for another headshot drop it nice and cleanly. Before I collect that rabbit up though, I'm going to go into a little gateway that's just down a little further here through this hedge as often there's a rabbit or two feeding out on the opposite side. And yes, I'm in luck. There's another one out. I estimate this one to be about 45 yards away. And I use this straining post here to give me a nice steady aim. I slip the trigger there and the shot's good and the rabbit goes down nice and cleanly. But as I approach here I can see that this rabbit was a bit further away than I estimated and the pellet struck a little low but it still gave a nice clean kill. And there you go, that was the uh, second rabbit of the two that you just saw me shoot and I've caught this one in the neck it was a bit further than I thought this one, it was at 50 yards, I thought it was at 45. I was aiming about here and the pellet has dropped and hit it in the neck, but still give a nice clean kill. So uh, we'll go around to the other side of the hedge and pick the other one up and show you that one now. And that there was the first of the two. That one, a nice clean headshot there at the base of the ears. Give a nice clean kill. So that's two rabbits that I've had in a field next door to each other. This is where having a good quality silenced rifle pays dividends. And uh, this rabbit didn't hear me take the shot at that one. Well, the light's fading really fast to me now. I think this will be the last one I get this evening. So we'll uh, just finish this field off and make my way home. So I'll stick these two in the bag where I'll prepare them once I get down near the van. It's been a lovely evening. And uh, I've had some nice shots there tonight, so I'm really pleased with how it's gone. And there's plenty more rabbits here to shoot at the next time I come. OK, 
Okay, let's finish this field off and see. Well, there we are, folks. That concludes my hunt for this evening. And I've had four nice clean kills, which you saw me take with the Theoban Rapid Mark II set at 30 foot pounds there. It's been a really enjoyable evening. So all I'm gonna do now is prepare these rabbits for the table like I always do in my other shooting videos, like I've said before. And uh, then I'm gonna make my way home. If you've liked uh, this video of me out hunting rabbits, please hit the thumbs up button and also subscribe to my channel. Thanks everyone for watching. Be safe, happy hunting to you all. Bye for now.